The ocean is a continuous body of salt water that covers more than 70% of the Earth's surface. Ocean current govern the world's weather and churn a kaleidoscope of life. Humans depend on these steaming waters for support and survival, but global warming and overfishing threatens Earth's largest habitat. Geographers divide the ocean into five major basins, the Pacific, the Atlantic, the Indian, the Arctic, and the Southern. Smaller ocean regions such as the Mediterranean Sea, the Gulf of Mexico, and the Bay of Bengal are called seas, gulf, and bays. Island bodies of salt water such as the Caspian Sea and the Great Salt Lake are distinct from the world's ocean. The ocean holds about 321 million cubic miles, or that is approximately 1.34 billion cubic kilometers of water, which is roughly 97% of Earth's water supply. Sea water's weight is about 3.5% dissolved salt. Ocean also uh, rich in chlorine, uh, magnesium, and calcium. The ocean absorbs the sun's heat, transferring it to the atmosphere and distributing it around the world. This conveyor belt of heat drives global weather patterns and helps regulate temperature on land, acting as a heater in the winter and, of course, an air conditioner in the summer. The oceans are home to millions of earth plants and animals, from tiny single-celled organisms to the gargantuan blue whales, the planet's largest living animals, fish, octopi, squid, eels, dolphins, and whales swim the open water while crabs, octopuses, starfish, oyster, and snail crawl and scoot along the ocean bottom. Life in the ocean depends on phytoplankton, mostly microscopic organisms that float at the surface and through photosynthesis produce uh, about half of the world's oxygen. Other food for sea dwellers include seaweeds and kelp which are types of algae and sea grasses which grow in swallower areas where they can catch sunlight. The deepest reaches of the ocean were once thought to be devoid of life. Since no light penetrates beyond 1,000 meters or approximately that is 3,300 feet, but then hydrothermal bands were discovered. These chimney-like structures allow tube worms, clams, mussels, and other organisms to survive not via photosynthesis but through chemosynthesis in which microbes convert chemical released by the vent into energy. Bizarre fish with a sensitive eye is translucent flesh and bioluminescent lures jutting from their heads eating bits of organic waste and flesh that rain down from above or on the animals that feed on those bits. Despite regular discoveries about the ocean and its uh, denizens, much remain unknown. More than 80% of the ocean is unmapped and unexplored, which leaves open the questions of how many species uh, there are yet to discover. At the same time, the ocean hosts some of the world's oldest creature like jellyfish have been around more than a half of a billion years. Like horseshoe crab is also as almost as long other long-lived species are in crisis. The tiny soft 
bodied organism known as coral, which form reefs, mostly found in shallow tropical waters, are threatened by pollution, sedimentation, and global warming. Researchers are seeking ways to preserve fragile ailing ecosystems such as the Australia's Great Barrier Reef. Sad to say, human activities affect the nearly all parts of the ocean. Lost and discarded fishes nets continue to literally snare fish, seabirds, and marine mammals as they breathe. Ships spill oil and garbage. They also transport critters to alien habitat and prepared for their arrival, turning them into invasive species. Mangroves, forests are cleared for homes and industry. Our garbage, particularly plastic, chokes the seas, creating vast garbage patches, such as the Great Pacific Garbage Patch. Fertilizer run off from harms turns vast swaths of the ocean into dead zone, including the New Jersey-sized area in the Gulf of Mexico. Climate change, the term scientists now use to describe global warming and other trends currently affecting the planet because of high greenhouse gas emission from human is strictly reflected in the ocean. The year 2018 marked the ocean hottest year on record and warmer waters led to a range of consequences from changing colors to rising sea levels to more frequent powerful storms. The greenhouse gas carbon dioxide is also turning ocean waters acidic and an influx of wa fresh water from melting glazer threatens to alter the weather driving current. The Atlantic Ocean currents have slowed by about 15% over the past few decades. A community of scientists, explorers, and citizen scientists continues to study the ocean hoping that more information will yield more paths for conservation. Underwater drones, for example, are being deployed to explore undersea frontiers, while new tools are helping scientists measure and understand what they find.